This is my video about tags. I am going to make it short and sweet because I already have them made. I only made, um, how many is this? Five? <laughs> Thanks, Cam. Um, so I just wanted to show you different, I mean, they come in different sizes, shapes, you know, you make them however you want. Use what you have on hand. Use scraps. Use trash use whatever you've got so um this is the first one i made i actually cut this from a thank you card you can see some of the words right there but that's okay i kind of like it um i use some of a doily this was another part of the card and it said something underneath it and then i put this sticker on top i'm sorry i'll come in closer this is a card this also, this banner was part of the card that I just fussy cut around and then glued it on here. Um, I apologize for my two-year-old crying. He's very cranky right now. And so it said something here, so I covered it with a sticker. And then you could see right here, you see this gold? That's nail polish, y'all. And I did the nail polish in here, too. Put a hole in it and put some pretty ribbon. And done. Super cute little tag. This one's really cute too. This was from, I think, a Project Life card or something like that. And basically, I just cut a heart out of paper, three different papers. Um, used, <laughs> kids are fun, used a scallop um, or, you know, used uh, the scissors, you know, that do the special things, whatever. This was from the doily. I just cut out the rows. And then I put some ribbon behind it and two staples to make it look like I did it on purpose, because I did. Uh, these little corners right here are from up here. Sorry, now it's going to focus. We're from up here. I just stacked them and glued them there. These are from this paper pack that I just fussy cut around and then stuck there. And again, stapled the ribbon up at the top. Oh, and added a little jewel, just for some extra bling. Super cute, super easy. This one is, I think this was another Project Life card. No, this was not. This was just a piece of paper that I had, and I cut it, and you could see I did not do a very good job because it's super uneven, um, no matter how hard I try, so I recommend measuring. <laughs> That'll probably be the only time I'll ever say to measure anything. <laughs> But, uh, so I punched a hole, um, I had these vellum sheets and I cut it out and glued those down. I put a little gem there and then this silver that's really shiny and shimmery is also nail polish. And then, um, or before I did that, I went around the edge with ink. And again, this time I just tied on a piece of ribbon instead of looping it through and stapling it on. I just wanted to give you guys different options. Here's another one. This was also a Project Life card that was already cut. Yeah, I really think this one was already cut. Um, and I inked around the edges. I really didn't do much to this one because it was kind of cool just the way it was. And then I just added this piece of, um, I think it's called trim, but I use it for tassels and stuff. And I think it was from this pack or something like that. And then I just cut, I think I did four strips, three strips of this little thin ribbon and then just fed it through. I actually glued the very back here with um, tacky glue so it would stay in place um, because I didn't have my... Uh, hot glue on gun out and I was doing this late last night and then last but not least this was this cute little card that I got I stapled again this ribbon I was fighting with my stapler that's why there's so many I used a little corner punch for the edges and then just some simple nail polish the pink and then the two greens and then the silver and that's it. I mean, they're super cute. They're easy to do in lots of different projects. You can even put them in your planner. I'm trying to think. Here. Let me see. Closest planner I have to me right now is my um, workout planner. So basically, you know, you could put it in. Let me get a paper clip. Sorry. I'm reaching. This is cute. Oh, that might be too hard. 
Let's just get a plain paper clip right now. Ugh, oh, and they're attached. Paper clips are annoying. No. So, you know, and just something cute and fun and decorative, you know, I mean simple if you want to put it in your planner or you can put it in your junk journal or your TN or you know so many different things these make cute little cards you can write something on the back you can embellish it way more than I did like I said I was just making these late last night I just wanted to showcase a few different ways of making things um, something that I really want to try is I really want to do sewing on the stuff like you know with pretty trims and stuff so that would be really fun to do um, glue hmm, that got messed up sorry <laughs> uh, you can even make some into oh, I don't show you that because I'm gonna that's going in happy mail <laughs> Oops. Uh, make them into like little shaker cards you know use whatever you have any kind of embellishments anything you have you could even turn these into paper clips you know all you have to do is just glue or tape the back and then psh, you know it's its own paper clip and that's kind of cool there's so many different things you can do so many ways to play with them you know these are just some you could do them really long and thin you could do them you know really thick and chunky or you know whatever you want guys this is totally a use what you have you know and get creative just pile a whole bunch of stuff on it you know we'll love it <laughs> but i hope you guys liked it bye